Hello, you guys. Happy, happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. I'm starting to vlog late today. I'm feeling much better. Thank you to all of you guys who wish me well because yesterday I was struggling. I'm feeling much better today. I hope you guys are all doing well. I hope you guys enjoy church if you go to church or whatever kind of worship service you do. I'm feeling much better. And I did call and quit today. <laughs> I called and quit. I was like, look, I'm just calling to let y'all know not to look for me anymore. I'm not coming back. And then <laughs> well, she wasn't prepared for that. So she was just like, oh, 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 okay. I was like, yeah, just want you to know I'm not coming back. So don't look for me today or any other days. Cause no, that was too much yesterday. And I didn't appreciate the stuff, breaks and stuff. So I quit but i did a little bit of packing things away today and i'm so ready to finally like clear things out of this house and stuff like my decor stuff i've had stuff just in the way for the longest time y'all and it's just been driving me insane but right now i'm about to eat i went and found me so colors isaac if you guys follow her here on youtube has been posting on Instagram her crab plates and stuff and she had me craving the seafood if y'all don't know I grew up in Jacksonville and it's like a year-round seafood festival pretty much they don't really know a lot about crab boils here in Virginia but it's kind of slowly coming up I've only known of one place that has it I found another one today and that's what I have I'm about to grub because I'm craving I wanted shrimp and the corn and the potatoes so that's what I ordered half a pound of shrimp corn and potatoes and I'm about to sit here and eat this whole bowl because I'm hungry and I've been wanting this and tasting this for a few days now I have me a nice big cup of water to go with it and yeah i'm about to sit here and grub and i should get my computer because i have a lot of channels that i follow that i need to catch up on or whatever so i can sit here and watch while i eat actually my computer's right here in my face duh i'm about to play me something on youtube because i'm a youtube junkie like everybody else i love watching my favorites and that's what i'm about to do while i sit here and eat i just wanted to come on say hello to you guys i don't really have anything planned for the day i did want to go and get my eyebrows done but i've been trying to let these eyebrows grow in they are struggling on the tails and that's why they always just look crazy because i'm trying to let them grow and it's just frustrating you guys so i used to have nice thick full eyebrows all the way across and now they struggle brows that's really all i have to go and work up in my beauty room my boss cave room i need to go and start pulling out all of my summer clothes i have to pull all my summer clothes down so that i can start putting some fall stuff up and i have to put up fall stuff of course now because i have to think about what's happening in my middle section you know my mid section so i'm just gonna be looking at stuff i have stuff packed in storage for fall and winter so hopefully sometime this week i can get dion to go to the storage and pull that stuff out for me so that i can get my stuff and just kind of get my wardrobe prepared for the weather changing because this week coming up the temperature is going to be in the low 70s high 60s and that's how i like it but i like it when i can be warm <laughs> so i'm about to eat and i will check in with you guys once i'm done eating all this shrimp corn and potatoes and yeah y'all will just kind of hang with me for a little bit today and yeah we'll see what happens in the vlog today so i'll see y'all in a minute after i eat <laughs> Go eat. <laughs> Y'all, she acts like I am starving her <laughs> every day. She does this bark thing every single day for both of their feedings to like, I'm starving her, hurry up and fix my food. She's so annoying, <laughs> but I'm working on their laundry right now because I, I told you guys yesterday they have a toddler bed and um 
I wash the sheets and then that's their little bed that I bring around the house wherever I am for them to lay on. So it goes in the living room, my bedroom, wherever, so they can be comfortable. I pulled the cover off of it so that I can wash that. And yeah, a lot of you guys have never seen this room, but this is the nursery room, you guys. I have a gallery wall for the dolls right now. They're my babies. But I want to do, there's two paint colors over here already and both of these are too dark i do not like them they've been up here i just haven't taken them down but when dion gets home we'll probably be going to get new paint colors and actual swatches so we can put it on the wall and see what the color looks like in different daylight this is their room soon to be nursery that we're going to be redoing um, there's this light fixture in here. There's a light fixture. It's a little small ceiling fan. I've never seen one this small until we moved in this house. <laughs> this was the previous owners. This was their daughter's room. And it's just a ceiling fan and stuff. But I think I want to change that out. I want to change that out and because the room is so small i told you guys i want it to be really simple not a bunch of stuff in here but this is the room i do like we like that we can do like a two-tone option i would like to do an accent wall i think i've been thinking about that a lot actually but i don't know which wall now at first in my mind i was like oh yeah i know how i want the nursery set up and i'll tell you i'll flip the camera so i can tell you how in my mind originally i wanted to do things so before i wanted crib on this wall dresser with changing pad and stuff on top on this wall over here and then a rocker glider recliner with a little side table situation over here and of course i want to use this shelf but i'm feeling like we're probably going to have to add something else for shelving in here but that's what i wanted but now i'm thinking about putting the crib on this wall right here which is right here by the door and then putting the dresser changing stuff on this wall right here i'm not too sure yet but um right now that's what i'm kind of going back and forth with regarding the nursery stuff on how i want things to go i guess it is earlier i don't i don't know i don't know if it's like a timeline of when you should start thinking about the nursery but for us because of dion's work and stuff we kind of have to get things done when we can get it done and we're kind of trying to start thinking about things now so that we can so we aren't scrambling at the last minute trying to do a whole bunch of stuff or whatever because his job requires him to be at work a lot so another update i want to give you guys is on my last vlog at the beginning of august i told you guys that i bought the toilet lights i love this thing in the middle of the night i'm telling you waking up in the middle of the night i hate having bright lights and stuff so the toilet light is a plus i love 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 this if you're interested in it i have it linked in the description box under my amazon store it is linked in there it's only like eight dollars and you get like four or something like that i love 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 that toilet light another update i want to show you guys is if you remember from my last vlog i had just gotten this faith cross print up here so i put that in the frame and this sonogram up here ultrasound photo is of my first baby who we call nugget and then this one was empty for the longest time and i got pregnant and now this is Bo in this frame here already on the wall and me and dion want to fill in the gallery wall it just we want to add something else to it i just don't know what i want to add to it yet but for now this is what it looks like and it looks complete i guess i'll just come sit back here in the kitchen i wanted to touch on some things from yesterday's video so i asked you guys for tips about how to include dion and thank you to everyone who has i'm gonna check the comment section now um, I still need to respond to some of the newer comments that came up. Some, oh, somebody mentioned to allow my husband to do the research on the stroller and the car seat and stuff like that. And I did. <laughs> I actually 
like I actually have three I've narrowed it down to three I started out with just one brand that my mind was set on when I have a baby this is what I want or whatever but now that I'm pregnant I'm actually starting to do research and stuff and wanting to compare things so I have three it's the Nuna mix with the Pippa Light LX car seat the upper baby cruise the single stroller with the combin the the with the kit for the Nuna I'm set on the Nuna car seat the only other car seat I have considered is the Maxi Cozy and the Maxi Cozy stroller I like the stroller click in car seat situation I like that idea and I'm really set on a light car seat because I didn't talk about it much or whatever or vlog when I had her but I kept my cousin's baby and the car seat was heavy <laughs> when I was carrying her around and I started keeping her at three weeks she was very light teeny tiny little thing so it wasn't a big big deal but when she got older and I kept her and having to carry that car seat and stuff I didn't have a stroller or nothing for her I ended up getting a carrier to put her in because that car seat business was just too much so I made a mental note that when I did have my own kid that the car seat had to be a light car seat and I wanted a stroller that I could take the car seat out of the car and click it onto the stroller that way I'm not lifting the baby waking the baby putting the baby in a new setup situation a lot of times the car rocks the baby to sleep so those were kind of mental notes that I already made but I gave Dion three to look at to research see what he likes and help him like understand that you can't just go out here and just grab any old thing because you want it to be functional for your lifestyle and for your family or whatever so he's he he is wanting to do that he's just been really busy with work really really busy i have only seen him like three days in the last month that's how crazy things have been you guys i haven't talked about it much but I've only seen Dion three days in a month. That's what I've been dealing with. I've been very emotional about it because he's been at work and away for work. And it's just so frustrating. <laughs> it's so frustrating, especially when I can't just pick up the phone and call him when I need him or when I need to hear his voice or anything like that. So it's just been very emotional for us. But he is wanting to look into strollers and car seats and stuff. He's also like, this is your dream. You know, you have all these visions for how you want things to go. And all I want is just for you to get everything you want. I want this whole experience to be just how you imagined it to be. And like everything is about me and what I want. And I'm trying to tell him like, but I want you to understand that your opinion matters in this too. It's not just about what I want because we've wanted this, but he is just always set on. I know you have, you like to decorate. I know you can't wait to decorate the nursery and you have an idea and I just want to make your vision come to life and all this stuff. Like that's what he gets excited about, <laughs> which is so sweet. I, I'm kind of getting a little uh, lump in my throat now thinking about it. I just love him. <sighs> that's what I'm working with oh somebody else mentioned a Doppler and today I actually considered a Doppler but I mentioned before I didn't really want to do one just because if I can't find that heartbeat y'all it's gonna freak me out and I don't want to intentionally be doing anything to freak myself out or cause me any unnecessary stress and stuff so I'm kind of on the fence about it I do have somebody who wants to give me one that I know like a friend of mine wants to give give me one of hers she has three kids and she found it very helpful with her last pregnancy I think she said but I want to try it I think but I'm I'm not sure it's just kind of like a line that I'm teetering you know but today my symptoms seem like they kind of just went away I had a little bit of nausea indigestion earlier and I was moving around got felt kind of like sick I don't know for the most part like it felt like my breast tenderness has went away and I remember before like when symptoms leave it just means something bad but I was like I'm not I'm not having anything else going on so I'm just just telling myself to chill out but the Doppler thing is something that I'm kind of considering I want to make sure that I answer you guys's questions and stuff yeah I think that's all I did have some more items once I went up into my little beauty room boss cave room I realized that I had stuff up there 
too for baby i got a little stuffed elephant as a gift and i bought baby a bear that was the first thing i ever bought outside of the book and then um i also bought a baby blanket up there i got it from nordstrom's over the summer but i forgot all about it and i went up there today because i don't go upstairs in my room anymore because i just i just hang out downstairs <laughs> my little beauty room is upstairs and i forgot that i had stuff up there but i really need to get up there and organize that room because it's a mess I am about to finish the laundry for the dog's room. I have some towels that I need to fold and I need to charge this camera so that I can continue vlogging for today for you guys. I love this, but the dogs are going crazy because Dion just pulled up. Hi, husband. Really what up? What's up, <laughs> Hi, husband. They all just ran outside. Dizo. Hey. Hey, bro. Why are you looking like you just got out of jail? I am out of jail. <laughs> what up? What up? Hi, husband. I've been smoking. You've been smoking black and brown? My boobs hurt. Are oh, your boobs hurt? Yes. Hey, boobies. Hi, hey, boobies. <laughs> What's up, boo? Hey, hi to the vlog. What up, shorties? It's dark. What up, boo? What up? What's up, black boy? What's up, black boy? Ah! He looks yeah. like he just got a doll, y'all. Dude. I miss y'all, man. You just don't know. I'm glad. I like your hair. Oh, you do? Mm -hmm. Hey, Bozy. <laughs> What's up, huh? You see the light? Uh -huh. What light? Oh, right here? Down here? Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> so you told Target to kiss your ass? <laughs> You gotta get to it. This yard been waiting on you for a month. My God. He hasn't cut the grass in a month, y'all, because he's been gone. Christ. Yep. Look at my yard. I oh. know. What the hell? You got work to do. The dogs are really, really excited. Everybody got balls to play. <laughs> Come on, Brooke. y'all this magnolia tree while it's pretty when the flowers bloom and stuff in the summertime you have to deal with all this it is ugly i hate that magnolia tree when the leaves start to fall look at him she got balls all over the yard i bought her a pack of them and she would never bring them back so i was giving them to her Diesel ah. on it. You gotta throw it for him. He like to he like to run after it too. Please, please. Diesel, quit trying to hurt. Diesel, Diesel. There's a mosquito on me. I'm about to leave y'all and go back in this house. I don't like all the bugs. Hey boy. Hey, 
I'm so glad you're home. Man, I know. What's up, baby? I missed you. Mm -hmm. My husband is home. Yeah. I was telling him I only saw you three days in the last month. Three days. Come here, Brooklyn. She missed Dion. What up, Moda Boda? Wait till you, wait till you, I was, I had started editing the footage for this vlog today and Brooklyn was behind me. <laughs> like, wait, I'm going to show you when we go in the house. What's up? I didn't know she was behind me tripping until I saw her in the vlog. Mm -hmm. I don't know what was at the refrigerator she was trying to get to, yeah. but it's something. She thinks she's a little princess with mm -hmm. Dion home, y'all. What's up? Hey. Let's go in the house. So I can tell you how Target tried me. They tried you. <laughs> Oh Lord, let me close out this what bulb. Happened? Huh? Oh, the light bulb just went out yesterday. It just went out. Yep, just in time for you. Alright. Y'all, uh, the vlog was fun and all today. Dion is home. <laughs> I'm all peace out. <laughs> and I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Bye. Mm -hmm.